Ooh, welcome back, Keith. I feel welcome. We, you know, we couldn't stay alone, uh, stay away for very long. It's like crawling back some, in the arms of a of a of a lover. Some images in this game lover. might be considered cruel or something. You know, you got to have that. I like this. What's this? This is our sweet intro we're watching here on uh, Silent Hill 4: The Room. Was that it? Okay. Could you bump the game up with my headphones? I could, I could maybe do that. Uh, wow, okay. Anyway, my name, Kyle Churchill. My name's Keith Carberry. We're cousins. We're, be we're best friends. We're best cousins. And, uh, we've done Let's Plays of the first three Silent Hill games, all blind. We've never played this game before either, and that's what we're starting on. I don't even know anything about this game. I know, I, I know, know a, a couple the, things. I know that this is the first uh, game in the series that was kind of had, kind of had mixed reception. Oh, oh man! The, if those things are in the game, I feel bad about this game. I heard this is the spookiest Silent Hill. People said that it was the spookiest, the creepiest. People were saying um, that this game had maximum spook. Is what I heard. Yeah, they were they were always talking about the maximum amount of spookage going on in Silent Hill for the room. They're like on a scale of the people when people talk about how scary a game is to this day, they'll say how scary is it on a scale of one to Silent spook. Hill four, aka maximum spook. <laughs> um, this is yeah. So so. Before we get started, I guess I'll just give my little quick intro to uh, to anybody who might be watching this for the first time, never seen one of our videos before. Our intention with our Silent Hill Let's Plays is to uh, is to give sort of a to show you what it looks like when we're playing Silent Hill for the first time. Mm -hmm. So we're not experts. And, we and not when not when any person plays it for the first time <laughs> when specifically we together play it for the first time yeah so we're gonna we're gonna make jokes we're gonna s tell silly stories and probably we're we're, like this game we're probably not gonna take the game very seriously all the time but we are gonna give it a fair shake we're, yes we're going I've, to try as hard as we can like i feel like we've done in the past a, Silent Hill a games. quick overview i think maybe me more so than you I really, really liked the first Silent Hill. I agree. I'm Silent Hill that. 2, I liked. I really liked certain things about it, but I think overall there were too many glaring issues, both with some of the way the to story was told and some of the gameplay that I didn't think it was as good as the original. For it to be fun to, a fun experience yeah. for us. And then 3, I think we both agree, like the gameplay was kind of like, meh, and like the story was just... Not even there. Not even. It was like non-existent. Yeah. And so... Silent Hill 4, I've mostly heard that it's not as good as the first three by a right. long shot, right. but some people really swear by it. Some people, yeah, and some I, people swear by this game. I think they tend to be the people that aren't, like, pre-existing Silent Hill fans that are, like, big into the lore or whatever, I don't know. Yeah, there are, there are, like, this game is, this game I, I feel like is sort of, has, like, this weird thing where they're, they're like, people still oh. fight about whether this game is good Two years ago that Henry Townshend moved into room 302 of South Ashfield Heights. In the medium-sized city of Ashfield, Henny was happy and enjoying his new life. Did you say Henny? Henny. Uh, but five days ago, something strange happened. He began to have a recurring dream each night. One other thing. One other thing. Brand new iPhone. He couldn't leave. <laughs> By the way, I'm also sick, so if I cough, it's because I'm sick. Wait, why couldn't he leave room 302? That seems like a... Well, that's the room. Is this our is our brightness too low? Are we supposed to be seeing things right now? I think that we're good. I think. Ooh. I oh, that's not a black. Oh, it's not black. Oh it's a fan. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good thing we we upped the brightness there. Yeah. No, I hate I hate to be. A stick uh, in the mud. I hate a to be a, a a nitpicker right off the bat. But saying this text right here, like, he began to have a recurring dream five nights ago. And one more thing. He couldn't leave. Like, that screams, like, fan fiction to me. I feel like that's fucking, like, doom repercussions of evil. Like, one more thing. He couldn't oh. leave his room. Oh, and by the way. I can't hear anymore. 
There was no sound. No, he was breathing, and then now I can't hear anything. Oh, no, there we go. Okay. Jeez. Right off the bat. What? What's the I mean? I think the I means that you can look at it. So, okay, so this is weird. So I have... I can look around with my right stick, and I can move with the left stick, but left and right on the left stick turns me also, like, like Goldeneye. That seems like a bad idea. Is that a mirror? No, the other thing was a mirror. That's a painting. It's like a church. Oh, okay. What's what's with this room? It's covered in blood and rust. It's not usually like this. Yeah, yeah. You're not old hat to a uh, or a, a room covered in blood and rust is not old hat to Henry Townshend as it is us. Because we see a room covered with blood and rust, and we go, "Oh, okay, we know yeah, exactly." We see that like on. We've got this game's number. It's like on the daily. Mm -hmm. We see it. I yeah, like I would say after after Silent Hill three, we probably wouldn't have kept going with Silent Hill. Um. Oh, I'm, I was just going to say basically the same thing as I think you're about to say. Yeah, but I feel like all the other ones after 3, and especially Silent Hill 4, have such uh, varying reputations that they were too interesting to not look at. Yeah, there's that, and then also like coming off being very negative about Silent Hill 3, and then oh, being... My pretty, red typewriter's gone. And then being pretty positive about uh, uh, the Silent Hills playable teaser. Oh, okay. was also another thing that i think like well doing this more. i mean i wouldn't call myself positive on pt but just because it was so terrifying that i didn't want to play it anymore yeah i on the other hand was not terrified but also i only watched people play it I did not and i think i think my i think bob's reaction when i was like pt was too scary he was like man i can't wait to, to watch you play silent hill 4 i was like ugh. i feel like there's no way this is going to be scarier than that i just feel like this can't be Prob scary probably not but it that some of those some of those uh, images I was seeing in that little intro bit. Do you think that it would spooky? Do you think that it would behoove us to? That's what a t what a terrible nightmare. My record player was replaced by a big <laughs> TV. No, they're trying to make me into one of the sheeple. They're tr they're, this this nightmare is trying to eliminate my personal Wait, identity. I'm these so are cool. His books. Someone replaced his books with someone else's books. I would never have bought Atlas Shrugged. <laughs> <laughs> Why are there three copies of The Fountainhead in here? <laughs> um. Oh, oh does that, that look like a face? Yeah, it's like a profile. It's like it's looking to the left, and it's kind of screaming. I don't see it. Oh, now, okay, I see it now. Creepy. That looked like a face. Uh, what was I saying before we started talking about Ian Rand? Oh, you still haven't got anything. Okay, thanks. <coughs> Jeez, when does Pyramid Head show up, right? Um, what was I? I was I was talking about something. Was very Dude, important. you know what? You never responded to me. I was thinking. Oh, okay. I, yeah, tell me. Sorry, this this came up in in my head because I remember I tweeted a picture of this game when it came in the mail, and someone responded and said, "Damn good game." Whoa, whoa, okay, something's happening now. Apparently, did you press a button? Nope. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna have to adjust the video cable. It looks a little flickery. Yeah, this is definitely not. It's also, it's also, uh, so there's old timey film scratches. That's something that happens a lot when your video cable gets loose. You get old timey film scratch lines on the screen. Charlie Chaplin just shows up. That's creepy. 
That's never good. You never want the like the violent head shake thing going on. That's no, never especially good. after someone has crawled out of a wall. <laughs> Dude, what is going on in my neighbor's house? <laughs> oh, rough night, Frank. <laughs> Frank, are you cool? So, they say that this is the last game made by Team Silent uh, over at uh, KCET, Konami Computer was, Entertainment Tokyo. I thought that was Silent Hill 3. It was Silent Hill 4, but that's okay. the thing is that there was, uh, I think, a large amount of turnover in the team. Yeah. Also, I, I think, think, what, I think what, Bob mentioned there was a, there was a bit of that. between all of them. Is yeah. What, I was but told. more so between three and four than any of the other ones. Mm -hmm. And uh, this game was actually not originally envisioned as a Silent Hill game. Somewhere in the development, it became Silent. It, it was supposed to just be The Room, and then it became Silent Hill for The Room. Uh, I think most people's guesses. I'm sure you know Silent Hill fans that have really looked into it and they know all this information probably have the real reason. I don't think there's anything Silent Hill fans haven't looked into. <laughs> right, exactly. But my my knee-jerk guess is just, oh, Konami went like, this is a horror game, it'll sell a lot more if you call it Silent Hill, so just do it. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. Oh, this is super a Silent Hill game. What a dream. This guy looks, this is a pretty good looking character model. Yeah. Not very expressive. Which is a quality I find to be good. What is this, 2004? 2004? This is a, a 2004 or 5. It might be 5. Two thousand four. Two thousand four. What I wanted to do was ask Siri on Mike, but I thought that might be a little too obnoxious for the first episode of a Silent Hill Let's Play. Yeah, yeah. Did there did any new viewers are dealing with enough the fact that I'll be coughing the whole time? Hello. Cut. Oh man, that phone rang by itself. How did it ring? How did it ring? They still haven't learned to make like digital. Like a cursor that snaps too? It's still, it's still just a cursor. Like, just let me pick the numbers, man. So now, now we, this is, that's clearly some kind of puzzle. Well, you know, you could try dialing 911. That always works, even if the, that's the thing about 911, always works, even if the phone line is cut. Yeah, that's why it's an emergency number. Or as a PT would put it, dialing 911. Is that a thing that PT said? Yeah, and the radio report that's playing, like, the whole time in PT, they it says someone dialed 911. They keep saying they dialed 911. Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, okay, I remember that. <laughs> what? That is the craziest <laughs> run. That's kind of goofy. <laughs> I've been waiting this whole time. Kid with the same run. Is there... That's fucking Is there, terrible. like, volume right now? Audio? Nope. Okay. We're looking out the window. You can't hear. You can't hear window. cars from your window? Sexy lady. Not this far away, though. You can tell they're far away, and the window's closed. Come on. There's that disgusting bus. All right. I guess then the guy... I think I'm good on looking. Mm-hmm. Oh. Now I can Ooh, see... you can look from a different oh. way. Oh. That's fun. What's happening in there? Do you think we're going to see more and more disturbing things through the windows as the game goes on? Yes, I do. Ooh, Bar Southfield. 
That must be a... The com- sequel bar to Barneelys? Yeah, a companion to Barneelys. I just randomly happened upon a, one of our Silent Hill 2 videos where we got really upset that the map said Neely's Bar. You're like, wait, it's supposed to be Neely's Bar? Not Bar Neely's? Yeah, Bar Neely's is a way better name than Neely's Bar. I don't know if that's true. Well, it's a it's a more interesting name that I have fun with. All right, we're good. Let's go. Um, Oh, do you think that it would do the Let's Play good to have us recording from different places so that you could be alone when you play i don't think that, i think that's what made you freaked I, out i don't think that would do me any good sorry i meant what, what i meant to say if i didn't is do you think it would do the let's play any good i don't think it would this do just could a lot of stuff i don't think it would do me any good yes but what i'm saying is do you think it would it, it would do well for the let's play keith i don't care because i couldn't you couldn't? What are you doing? What do you think you're doing? This is I don't know. It, the, the game decided that I needed to look at that chest, so I figured maybe there was a reason, but I think it just wanted me to know about it. This guy's a fucking liar. What? He said he didn't have a big TV. He totally has a big TV. He was like, oh, where'd my record player go? Like, it was just whoa, like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, hold on. Are you trying to say that, that, that you're holding him accountable for the shit he said in his dream? I don't know. We're in, we're in, we're in I think he was trying. Hill, I think he was bringing man. like a hipster girl over, and he's like, "Oh, whoa! I don't even know where this TV came from. Usually, I only have like a a record player with a bunch of forty five. I don't watch TV. I just binge Netflix and Hulu. <laughs> <laughs> Through the ritual of the Holy Assumption, he built a world. It exists in a space separate from the world of our Lord. More accurately, it is within, yet without, the Lord's world." Unlike the... That's a lot. Yeah. Unlike the world of our lore, it is a world in extreme flux. Unexpected doors or walls, moving floors, odd creatures, a world only he can control. Anyone swallowed up by that world will live there for eternity, undying. They will haunt that realm as a spirit. How can our lord forgive such an abomination? This part of the book is too damaged to read. It is important to travel lightly in that world. He who carries too heavy a burden will regret it. Oh. That's why you probably have that chest, so you can pick yeah. and choose your inventory. <sighs> encumbrance, huh? I don't think it's encumbrance. I just think that, like, the lighter you travel, the better the ending you get. <laughs> I think that's what it is. No, oh, no. no. Yep. Um, that's where my money is. Your money is often placed in really strange... Places. Right now I have uh, $380 wrapped up inside a tube of uh, half-used uh, paper towels in my closet. That's real. Don't break into my house. I don't I don't like this save, save point noise as much as the other save point noises. Show me. Yeah, it's not as good. It's not as comforting, and that's what you want from a save point. You want it to feel comforting. Yeah. How does it feel to have the this style of control right now it um the the left stick this stuff feels fine uh it's it's the right stick is like way too sensitive i feel like is there no sensitivity option i guess i could check we're playing on the xbox by the way if that wasn't obvious the xbox original yes uh the xbox one you might call it yeah some might call it that you know who doesn't call that microsoft Mm-hmm. What did you uh, say? You didn't feel like cooking? Doesn't feel like cooking. Oh, just in general? I don't really want to wash my hands right now. I really hope that means he cooks later on, but I don't think that's so. Sort of, that's sort of my favorite thing about, and we've talked about this a, b- a billion times. Yeah. Like, the things that the oh. Silent Hill protagonists say when you look at stuff. Yeah, yeah, Like, those instances where you clearly have a different... Ooh, no, let's watch this. That's when I first had the nightmare. I haven't been able to get out of my room since then. That seems like a problem. The phone doesn't work. The TV doesn't work. Something. My whole world has been suddenly turned insane. My door's chained up, but the windows are sealed. The windows sealed shut. And on top of that, someone chained the door from the inside. I think it's really weird that they're, um, 
they're they're framing this like it happened five days ago so he's already used to it like same old same old can't get out of my weird room for no reason <laughs> like why would you not start what's going on here you know like it said the door said don't go out so the idea is that he put it there right no, I don't think so. I think the idea is the idea is that Man. he woke up one day and his door was bolted shut with a million. But it's chains. bolted shut from the inside, is what he said. Well, yeah. Who else is in the room to bolt him up? Anything's possible in the mid-sized city of Ashfield. <laughs> Just make it take place in Silent Hill, you fucking assholes! I'm so sick of this. I'm going to be really upset if there isn't even, like, a place in the game that is Silent Hill. Like, I'm hoping that the, the place where you go to play the game is Silent Hill. But Silent Hill can come to you. No, that sucks. It can be in. It's a state of mind. That sucks. It's a spooky town. It can be Oh, that's that's not an appropriate load screen. That's terrible. Well, wait, what was it? It was just, like, a picture of, like, a... Like a white-faced creepy person just flickering all around the screen. Oh, so you see it was creepy, not that it was off tone. Yeah, no, it was just creepy. What? Anyway, yeah, I think you're right. It is weird that he is, after five days, discovering oh, 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 what his bathroom looks like. Oh, pipe, pipe. S somebody in there? Yeah, I don't understand why. I mean, hopefully this is something that is fleshed out in the story later. I just don't have high hopes because it's Silent Hill. I, maybe the idea with this this thing is that this hole wasn't here the other four nights. Maybe. It's your door said don't go out. Maybe you should stay in. Right? Well, I don't know. Yes. Fuck yeah, I did. Three foot long sewer pipe. Not very powerful, but fairly easy to use. I, I would. I would Why do they have to qualify so? Easy. It's fairly easy. I'm hearing some weird things, you guys. Ooh, what's that meter? I would assume that's my health. I would assume that's my health points. You're saying you don't have to look and see how flickery a picture is? What? Of course there's no one in the bathtub. Be serious. <laughs> so, what I was saying was, like, the moments when what you're doing as the player is different from the protagonist's intentions. Like, you looked at the sink, and then the character is deciding, like, but I don't want to wash my hands. Yeah. I wonder if they just got the idea to make uh, PT or Silent Hills as a whole first person from this stuff. This is pretty... We talked about this in the PT quick look. I mean, wait, no, wait we don't do quick looks. We don't do quick looks. This is not us. You have to edit that out or we'll get sued. Oh, no. Yeah. Dan Reichert will CBSI, come down CBSI is going to get their lawyers on us. Uh... We, we talked about in the PT Let's Play that, like, first person is the scariest person. It is. It's way scarier than third person. Second Cause... person, most confusing person. <laughs> yeah. How do I get down there? How do I get at that? Don't go out, Walter. Mom, why doesn't you wake up? That's creepy. You're not mom. We're just in the bathroom. What am I, what am I doing? I have a very good doctor here in the mid-sized city of Ashfield. Mm-hmm. Have you tried to go through the hole? Kyle? Well, it's at Silent oh, Hill there. Oh, oh, just a quick shot I took in downtown Silent Hill. It's a nice tourist town about a half day's drive from here. That's a long drive. That is a long drive. He said it like it was nothing. Yeah. Eh, it's just about a half day's drive. That's 12 That's hours. That's 12 hours. <laughs> That's a lot of Maybe hours. Maybe he means a half waking day. Yeah, which would be... Six hours to eight hours. Yeah, about eight hours. It's still quite a... quite a. Uh, it's quite a drive. Quite a drive. That's not one town over. No. Yeah. That's not even in, like, the same state. Oh, that dude's getting into it. Look at that. Well, it's not in the same state in New England. 
I guess if this is supposed to take place in like California, then yeah, maybe. Or definitely Texas. It kind of looked like that guy was freaking out in some kind of horror like fashion, but I think that's just supposed to be him I enjoying think his music. Yeah, I think yeah. he's just dancing. Um, how about Maine? You could probably get six hours in Maine without leaving Maine. Yeah, I mean, if you're going north, but what is there six hours north into Maine? Well, I mean, you could start north and go south. Well, I mean, I guess if you're starting from Canada, then yeah, that's true. I uh, Sometimes I forget that the northern tip of Maine doesn't just jut out in nowhere into the ocean. Yeah. But it is connected to Canada. It's connected to Canada. It's all of Canada. Which, you're right, is basically nothing. P.S. Canada. Sorry, I forgot you exist. It's okay. We're used to Ooh, it. laundry room. That was all of Canada that I was doing. That's how they sound. Mm. Mm, nah, it's okay. It's okay. Don't worry about Don't it. Don't worry about it. Hey. Well, this is... Uh... Did you try the fucking hole in the bathroom? Yeah, I got the pipe out of it. Yeah, and then you're supposed to crawl through it. Oh, I'm stupid. Yeah. That's what I've been saying for like six minutes. Uh, what? Uh, uh. Oh, okay. I mean, you've still been. I mean, it's you've still been looking at stuff that you haven't looked at. I so keep doing like, stuff where like I want to strafe left and look right, so I'll do left and right on the yeah. control sticks, and it. Oh, you is... mean how video games have worked since four years before this game came out? Yes. Good job, Silent Hill, killing it on control schemes. Nothing happens. Do you hear like whispering? No. You Are you that? hearing whispering? Yeah, there's like. What's wrong with you? No, there's nothing. Nope. You don't hear that? No. Oh my god. Are you sure you're okay? Do you see the person in the bathtub? <laughs> Keith, of course there's no one in the bathtub. Did you check the sink for a chicken baby? That was just the fetus baby. That's what babies look like before they're born, Keith. There's Nicole's going to have one of those inside of her. Is it going to talk in a weird, raspy, angry John Goodman voice? Probably. <laughs> like, if it could talk, it, it, like, it, it definitely would. It isn't the time for that kind of thing. You definitely can't go through that thing? Yeah, there you go. What the fuck? Yeah. I was looking straight at it. I don't know. That that was put straight into uh, um, Lone Survivor. There was totally a moment in Lone Survivor where you just have a weird hole in your in your bathroom wall and you climb through it like a nutcase. What? Wait, this is not how bathrooms work. Keith, we're in the mysterious mid-sized city of Ashfield. <laughs> this is gonna be a... Where anything is possible within a 10-mile radius. This is, a, this is a pretty nice effect. Yeah. I'm not spooked. Are you spooked? No, I'm not that spooked. I would say, like, I'm a little... I've got, like, a mild spook going on, you I'm know? Like a one out of ten spook-wise. It's like a, you know, it's like a mild, like a Tostitos mild salsa. Like, it's there. I can enjoy it, but it's not, you know... Wait, hold on. on top Let's of talk me. about that for a second. You can taste the spiciness of a Tostitos No, no, no. I mean, salsa. like, it's like it is a f material thing oh, that I can eat. Oh, you can literally taste it, is yeah. what you're saying. Exactly. So, I think the equivalent is that you understand that this is a video game, <laughs> but no, it's not spooky. <laughs> I can recognize this as an interactive piece of software that I am manipulating. This isn't what apartment buildings look like, bro. Keith, Keith. Do I have to explain the mysterious powers of the mid-sized city of Asheville to you one more time? Do you? Can you tell me how many blocks it is to the nearest uh, right aid? Two up and eleven over, you simple bitch. <laughs> uh oh, Keith. Uh oh, Keith. Yeah. This is not tank controls. Oh, thank God. Ugh. You know what that means. Give me that controller. I do have to hold B to run, though. Now you got to play Tenchu. Fuck off. 
Hold on, you did not like playing Tenchu. So? So this should be, you should get, you should be like, okay, thanks for playing Tenchu for me. Here, Ooh. now you also get to Look play Look at that, Silent look Hill. at that, that's nice. That's, I mean, that's the same move that you've had for three other Silent Hill that's games. That's probably true. Keith, I can't remember, it's been so long. It hasn't been that long. It's been so long. We just, we just finished Silent Hill 3 like six months ago. It's been a long time. This looks like the South Ashfield subway station. But I don't think this should be here. <coughs> Fuck this thing. One day that'll work. You're saying that you want a Silent Hill game with 100% destructible environments? Dude, yes. Not only that, I want a Silent Hill game where... Locked you know, door is a thing of the past. Oh, that's a creature. No, that's a lady. I want a Silent... Are you ladies or creatures? I want... I want a Silent Hill game where at least 30 to 40 percent of the uh, development budget goes entirely to uh, creating destructible environments. I want to. I want to make it clear. I'm saying that pe all people are creatures. Yeah, not specifically not just women. Ladies. Who are you? Your What's next your boyfriend. Name? Oh, Henry looks like such a creep all of a He's sudden. He's got a weird voice. This is my dream, and you don't even know my name. Uh oh. It's Cynthia. Your dream. This is. That's right. <laughs> this is just a dream. And a really terrible one, too. I hope I wake up soon. So you think this is a dream, huh? Well, if it's not a dream, what is it? She must be on nuke. Get out of here, but I can't find the exit. Cindy, will you help me find it? I'm kind of scared all alone. I'll do a special favor for you later. He can't resist. <laughs> it's just a dream, so I might as well have some fun. Yep, definitely a dream. Okay, hold on. So. People saw that cutscene and went, "This isn't a real Silent Hill game." Like that, <laughs> right? Dude, that was that the was the most Silent, Silent Hill. Hill. <laughs> yeah, like that is exactly that. You could have put that in any of the previous Silent Hill uh, well, games. To, it more to the point, sense. that was almost literally like the Maria introduction cutscene from Silent Hill Two. Yeah. Um, and this, hasn't there been a Silent Hill character named Cynthia already? Anyway, no, no. It does sound very much like a Silent Hill character, though. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. I couldn't tell you why. Oh, man. I don't think this is Cynthia's dream. Oh, man. You're not pregnant, are you? Bummer. Wait, you don't have an ectomorph about to pop out of your abdomen, do you? Bummer. Wait, your captain isn't a robot, is he? Bummer. Wait, what? Well, we were doing ectomorphs. Was the captain in the movie Alien a robot? Yeah, that was the whole thing. I don't remember. It was. Yeah. It's been so long since I've seen Alien. It was. I only saw it once. I should probably rewatch it. It's really good. Wait, that's not the bathroom she went into. Then who's opening this bathroom? That thing. That thing did it. Yeah, I see that. Now it's got two mouths. That ain't right. Mm, no. That ain't right. Oh no, it just has weird lips. What the fuck? Cannibal vampire tongue dogs. Oh man. Can I just skip over the- oh, I have right stick camera control. I think I you have to hurt those. Yeah, you're gonna have to hurt those. Kyle, can you do me a favor? I want this to be- this is a test of your Silent Hill combat skill. Okay. I need you to kill these dogs while reciting that comment that you've memorized from our Silent Hill 1 Let's Play. Uh, they're not called bat vultures, they're called air screamers, and they're Alessa's interpretation of the pterodactyls as depicted in one of her favorite novels, The Lost World by Arthur Conan Doyle. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. 
Jeez, these How things have have health. Yeah. My goodness. How's this combat feel? Uh, it an improvement or a or not, uh, or the opposite of that. I'm going to tentatively say improvement. Okay. Do you think that part of? Oh, okay. I see how it works now. Attack? Yeah. You got that meter up at the top. That's how you hold it down, and then you unleash. Oh, so you got different levels of power. Yeah. Do you think that part of our um sort there of uh, uh that's, that's like the heavy swing Silent Hill is the fact that we keep expecting improvements to the gameplay and they keep not coming? Uh cuz it definitely it definitely feels like each game is taking strides in ways that are not the way Let me guess. Now in in the light of this I'm just going to leave this woman here. I I feel like I would have been perfectly happy if like the exact gameplay, like literally the exact same way that the characters move and operate in a Silent Hill 1, if it stayed that way, I think that would have been fine. I actually felt like Silent Hill 2 and 3 actually made it worse. I agree that they made it worse, but I feel like I don't know, I feel like that like it, they didn't make it worse by making changes that didn't work. They made it worse by exacerbating the problems that they already had. Yeah, had yeah, exactly. Was. These things really can take some damage. They really do. But then again, I guess I'm not supposed to fight the enemies in Silent Hill. Maybe they got rid of that. I don't think they got rid of that. No, me neither. Maybe I should go check out these payphones. You know, you know these phones that would be in public, and you would put money into them to make a phone call. Why would anybody pay money to use a phone that you get carry in your pocket? It's so funny. I was at like a back around Christmas. I went to um, background Foxwoods? Christmas. I think I went to Foxwoods. Oh, back around Christmas. Back around Christmas. Yeah, and. Uh, there was just this in the main lobby. There was this part off to the off to the side where you could tell it used to be a bank of like ten payphones, and they have since removed all but one of them. So there was like one payphone, and then just like weird little cubbies with nothing in them, like nine of them. That sounds sad. I think like recently. I, I mean, not that casinos aren't inherently sad anyway. Yeah. I, I, I recently had someone come up to me and ask me if they knew where, if I knew where they could find a payphone. I was just like, no, sorry. I like literally have no idea where a payphone might be. Yeah. Step, step one, find a TARDIS. <laughs> find a TARDIS, just use the phone inside of it. Yeah. Ooh, that's a big worm. Should I just avoid these things? Wait a minute. Do I have a map? Yes! Oh my god, it's hand drawn. It's even better. Yes! Turn style. Should I just. I should just run past these things, right? What is, what is that thing doing over there? That's not. That's no good. I don't like that. That. Oops. Was working right. Whoa! Yeah, fucked up. Whoa! Excuse me? How is this dog charging me like this? Uh, so I don't think that you're supposed to be avoiding these dogs. Ten cents a minute? Seriously, dogs? Well, 25 cents and then 10 cents for each minute after Okay, that. yeah, let's not avoid these dogs because... Damn. Yeah. Run! Run! God! Shit. I think you're just gonna die right now. No! Alright, you got this. You fucking got this, champ. No, no! Ugh! 
I can't believe that. Those things are so hard to kill. It's crazy. Game over. You saw me try to avoid him. I saw you. I, I saw tried. You tried to avoid him. They're too good. And now we're never gonna do that again. Now we're yeah. You like that? Now we're never we're gonna never do that gonna again. Do again. In any game. Let me just see if this would work though. Okay. You've had an iPhone forever. Why are you all of a sudden interested in Siri? Siri, what year did Silent Hill Four come out in? <laughs> Siri. Okay, I found this on the web for Siri. What year did Sin Mod AO for come out? <laughs> well, there's your answer. It, it it translated to what year did San Mateo Four come out in? <laughs> Cortana wouldn't know. Siri, what year did Silent Hill 4 come out in? Let me think about that. It put okay, its... Okay, I found this on the web for what year did Silent Hill 4 come out in. The problem is... F-O-R. F-O-R for 4. Maybe had maybe to 4. Which I 4? Silent Hill 4? Siri... What year did Silent Hill number four come out in? Oh my god, it still did FOR. You suck. Okay, I found this on the web for what year did Silent Hill number four come out in? Siri, what year did Silent Hill Arabic numeral four come out in? It's still doing it. Okay, give me a moment. Okay, I found this on the web for what year did Silent Hill. What year did Silent Hill 4 come out in? Nope. Nope. I thought that's, I could get it with that's 4. That's some garbage. 